there's a chance they could take the number one defensive end on the board. I'm ready to go. Uh, oh, I missed badly. Start green. Over by the 12? Yeah. <laughs> Added to Kumbo. <laughs> Ogunjai. Added Kumbo. Oh. Yeah, Okandushi. He's a Add a Kumbo the... Okandushi. Yeah, yeah. Add, add to combo. Add to combo. <laughs> Ogundaji. Ogundaji brings the kind of functional strength and relentless effort to make an early impact. He's like what? He can move furniture? <laughs> <laughs> he can get open a jar of pickles, no yeah. problem. When you, when you can't get that jar open, call on this fella. Yeah, you're going to help me move a couch. Okay, weak points. O Ogundaji isn't an edge burner. He's wound a little <laughs> <laughs> what you looking at? Yeah. <laughs> Don't talk to me like that. I got bills. <laughs> He's wound a little tight. What was that? Yeah. Talking to me right now. Like my, like, like my wife coming home yeah. from work. Got a lot on my plate. Lighten up, Francis. It's not that bad. I can't believe I agreed to do this. Here comes Ogan Dushy. There's always something the matter with him. Delivering refrigerators for Best Buy. <laughs> His ceiling isn't particularly high. But his floor is reasonably solid. <laughs> Again, with that functional strength and effort he showed at the collegiate level. So that's maybe the highlight of the Felgram as big board. Week one. Week one is in the books. Almost. So I thought we'd just put a few kickers on the board. Because I think kicker's still a position in need. Wouldn't you say, Maz? You want Mike? Hell yeah. Hell okay. yeah, I want a kicker. Yep. No credit. Now, punter, not a position of need. But we do need a kicker. So, you know, we, we uh, Nick Folk, I think, has been re-signed, right? So he has. you have him, but ideally you'd like to draft the next guy. So we're going to throw a few markers for the kickers. Murray's there. Maz is holding in our Town Fair Tire Studios. I'm remote. I still have the, the bios in front of me. So you hit. I read. Go ahead, fellas. Okay, so actually Tyler, the milkman, is going to hold, and Murray oh, and I are going to whip. Yeah, Perfect. Get behind the board. <laughs> Put your head down. I'm gonna yeah, the there you go, Tyler. Hide behind the board. There you go. Good job. Wham! Oh! oh. Murray, Murray oh, took down the mag and it went in the trash. <laughs> but it should have hit the magazine. It did. It hit the top middle of the page. Uh, uh, Tyler, just read the name. Oh, jeez. Hold on. Let me help him out. Presley Harvin III. George Say it again. Pack. Say it again. Presley Harvin III. Presley Harvin III. Tech. Georgia Tech, stand by. I have the bios. Um, Tyler, that, that thing you only had, it's called a magazine. I know you're just used to, you know, computer screens. And That's actually called a magazine. They actually used to print these. Uh, yes, okay. Uh, I hit the other one, and then we'll talk about Presley Harvin. Okay, here we go. Bottom. Bottom right or closest to? Closest to the photo. Uh, here we go. <laughs> Evan McPherson, Florida. Okay, all right. Want to just do two? Yeah, yeah two's three? enough. Two's okay. enough. I agree. Let's we'll okay. stop with two. All right. So Presley Harvin the third. <laughs> Holy crap! Is any relation to Percy Harvin? Yes. <laughs> There's no gambling at Bushwood, and I never slice. Per Pre Presley Harvin the third. He's a punter. Oh, see then, he see, this the was the name. problem. There was kickers and punters on that Hold same Hold on, I'll give you the right page. name. Hold on. Frick Milliken. See, he doesn't want to handle a magazine. He's yeah. never. He's probably never handled a magazine, this kid. <laughs> it's all computer screens and spreadsheets. He doesn't even know what a magazine is. Uh, I'll, uh, hold on, I'll give you the other one. What was the other one you said? Uh, from Florida. Evan McPherson. Yeah, Evan, Evan McPherson, McPherson, Florida. Okay? Uh, if you care, he's 5'11 and 185. Uh, strengths. Natural power as a kicker. McPherson was able to hit from 55 yards this season and hit it with ease. Accuracy is a big plus to McPherson's game, having a career field goal percentage of 85%. Even McPherson's missed kicks looked impressive, just barely riding the outside of the posts. Weaknesses. McPherson had a down year, making just 77% of his field goals in 2020. The blip shouldn't raise too much concern, but it was a step down teams will investigate. His kicks are controlled. He doesn't offer the same amount of power others in his class offer, which could hurt his appeal. You know what hurts his appeal, Maz? What? Florida. Oh, right. Yes, absolutely. Florida. So he kicks in good weather on grass, and I, I bet they'll hold that against him.
You know, I mean, I, as south as they want to go is Memphis. Where, where was the, where, where was the guy from the Posse Comitatus from again? I forget. Marshall, Last year, right? Marshall, yeah. Marshall. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I, I, I just don't think they're going to go for warm weather or dome or grass kicker, right? You want someone who's used to the elements. That's a big part of it here. All right, so who's our other selection? Message? Okay, so Mike, you got to go to your Lindy's Magazine, 82, page 82. Yep. Riley Patterson is the guy. Okay, Riley Patterson. Riley Patterson from Memphis. Okay, Memphis. Hey, isn't that where Goskowski was from? Memphis is exactly where Goskowski was from. Oh, Memphis. Oh, here we go. Okay. Strengths demonstrates natural power on kickoffs with hang time and distance to consistently get touchbacks. Uh -huh. Has good touch, putting some kicks right at the goal line. Kicks soar high in the air with ease and great loft. Power was shown on a converted 58 yard field goal this season. <laughs> Potential is through the roof given his natural leg strength. Didn't, again, the war Wasser kid hit like a 60 yarder yeah this yeah. last year that so, was that uh, one clip that went everyone everywhere and was like yeah this is going to be a stud kicker so <laughs> this kid this kid's projected in the late rounds or oh, they all are they're kickers for crying yeah, out right God. so but, but, leave it to bill to take one in the fourth though yep but you know what this is the kind of guy they should take folks a little long in the tooth you gotta, you gotta get a kicker for the long term no they already do this is the thing they're not going to take a kicker do you know who the backup kicker is no, is it the YouTube guy? Roberto Aguayo, that stiff that Tampa moved up to take like five or six years ago and was immediately a disaster as soon as he came into the NFL. The kid from Florida State who was a jittery idiot and went, has been on like four other teams, and now he's a reclamation project here. Well, let's see if these two kickers can upgrade on the jittery idiot. Okay, that's that's the goal. Put those two on the board. We'll come back with um, what, what I think is a fascinating story, this whole number change in the NFL and how Tom Brady and the Patriots have reacted to it. I want to get to that in our long commercial-free segment next. We have Gasper standing by on the top of the next hour as well, so some good stuff coming up. Don't go anywhere. Boston's home for sports. Failure.